Can you maybe share some exercise or technique for our viewers, which you think is uh, kind of practical and quick? <laughs> well, one of, one of the... May, may, may I just say, Rowan, please, instead of describing it verbally, can you just, can we just do it together? Sure, sure. Yes, that's a, that's a great idea, Daniela. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think the, the simplest, I mean, there are, are a number of heart math techniques that allow us to shift into this heart coherent state. Uh, that are designed for different purposes. But I'm, I'm just going to, they usually have uh, three or four steps. But the first step is the, the often the most important one. And just this step alone, many people can get a lot of a, almost immediate benefit from practicing. And it's something that uh, before we do it, just to say you can do it anytime, anywhere. Uh, you don't have to, it's not a, a necessarily meditation. You can have your eyes open. You can do it while you're driving. You can do it if you're talking with somebody and the, you know, the discussion's not going the way you want and you're starting to get frustrated or impatient. This is something that you can do and it's called heart-focused breathing. Mm. Just all do this right now. You can, keep, you can close yes. your eyes or you can keep them open. And what you do is you focus your attention in the area of the heart, right here in the center of the chest. And imagine your breath is flowing in and out of your heart or chest area. Now, you want to breathe a little slower and deeper than you normally do and find a rhythm that's comfortable. Okay, so just hard focus breathing. And by the way, a lot of people with, with practice will actually feel like an energetic flow in and out of that part of the body. About half the people they experience that. So as you continue hard focus breathing, Activate a positive feeling. This could be a feeling of appreciation that you have for someone or some place, someone you care about. Right? You want to breathe the feeling of that. For a lot of people to, to help with this, it might be to remember the feeling you have when your pet greets you and you come home and you're your dog or your cat jumps in your lap. Or it could be the feeling you have at a special place that you love to go to the beach or the forest, that feeling you have when you're there. Just but as you continue the heart focus breathing, just breathe in that, that feeling, that feeling of appreciation or care or love. And just by doing that simple exercise, we are prime, we are making major shifts in what's going on in our body that help increase our vitality, improve our health. Let's get the heart and brain in sync so we can make this is a, a wonderful thing to do before you make any any kind of important decision. Right? Or when you're starting to feel frustrated or, or impatient in a traffic jam. Yes. Right. Or with a family member. It helped me. <laughs> yeah. Amazing. Mm -hmm.